Is your pension performing poorly? Let's have a look at one particular uh, reason why. We're going to have a look at St. James's Place Global Smaller Companies Pension Distribution. Okay, so how's the performance? Uh, oh, I look so... Uh, no, it doesn't. That's the index, which they're underperforming. So you would have been better off with an index tracker, which is always the case, pretty much, with St. James's Place. What are their returns like over five years? Well, the index is up 50%. They've done half as well as that. Thanks for nothing. What have they put things into? North America? Smaller companies? Okay, yeah, you can have North American smaller companies. A bit of Japan. 1.5% uh, in Africa and Middle East. What's the freaking point? 1.5%. Emerging America? 3%. You know, when it's so small, what is the point? Let's look at their holdings. Oh, my Lord. Under one, Their biggest holding is under 1%. Everything else is 0 0.18, 0 0.17. I can tell you now, that is going to be a complete waste. And I'll explain why. They're smaller companies. Let's say one of them goes up 100%, right? This is how much confidence they've got in their abilities, they're that confident they've put 0.17% into this particular company, whatever it is. So if it does go up 100%, okay, they will make and add 0.17% to the portfolio. Pointless. Next to nothing. Okay, what's the point of it? No wonder they're underperforming. What they've actually said and done is we are so rubbish at what we do, know so little about what we need to do that we're going to put next to nothing in every single individual company. And if any of them do well, which we obviously don't expect, because if we did, we'd put more money in them. If they do well, they'll make no difference to your portfolio whatsoever. But we're going to keep charging you the fees. So what are we actually trying to protect against? We're trying to protect against falls. Well, my bank account will bloody well do that, mate. It gives me 4.5% in the past year, whereas they destroyed 3.3%. So wait a minute. By just having my money in a bank account in the past year, I've done 7.8% better than them. Let alone the fact I'm comparing with a bank account. The NASDAQ was up 55%. The Dow was up 25%. And they managed to lose money during that period when a majority of their assets in a, are in North America? Amazing. They have found a new way to lose money when everybody else was making it. That's pretty impressive. Well done, fund manager. Who is it? They've only got the one fund manager, Kevin Beck. Guess what? They've got £700 million of other people's money in there. £700 million. Pounds. That tells you something. People are stupid. They will piss away their pensions and give it away. Incredible. Have a look at the links in my bio if you want to actually do things the right way. I used to write about this when I was writing my weekly Financial Times column. I've written about this problem in my 18-odd books published by the Financial Times, Palgrave Macmillan. It was because, it, because of this I set up a hedge fund, which isn't open to retail clients, so I'm not plugging a fund uh, before you ask. I created my campaign for a million.com to teach a million people for free how to be better at investing so they could add an extra million across their lifetimes into their pensions. The job's really easy. You know why? Because that's the bar. That's how rubbish everybody else is. Okay, thank you very much.